All right, what's going on? Let's do some show hacker news. I saw this one. I had to click on it. Vomitorium, all of your projects in one text file. You link to the NPM. Why not link to the Git? So who made this? Justin Wolcott. Oh, yeah. He, this motherfucker does some <laughs> interesting things. Jay Wally. Wolcott.io. Let's take a look what you got there. Nothing? What? <laughs> uh, love it. You made me laugh. <laughs> I think I made this before. Yeah, I did actually. It's called Stamp. Do I have a command line tool? They call it vomit. <laughs> I have the okay, I have unvomit. <laughs> if you want to put the vomit back into your mouth, you use stamp. Um oh yeah, this this guy. I don't know how to pronounce this. I'm not even gonna try and embarrass myself. Um that's goose, by the way, doing a prince cover. It's fantastic. Okay. We do have some some prior art now. Obviously, this is a joke, but it's not really because you got it. Why are you making me do this, man? I'm gonna be your first star. How about that? Did you write this or did no um write this? So, let's talk, talk serious for a moment. So Stamp, actually use Stamp in production. It's good for doing temp templates. Oh yeah. But would you really wanna vomit up? I mean, I, I, so I'm faced with this problem right now. I wanna vomit up all of the scroll directory into an LLM. Basically, I just want to vomit out a great prompt given a folder. So can you iterate and um, not just Great file extension. <laughs> um, so look up particle notation because this might actually be good for you. Um, what the hell? Just gonna scroll and click on where's the particles? Particles. Sorry, I'm just looking for this thing right here. So just to vomit here's the file name we know if there's a 
it's a forward slash in the file name. Sorry, I gotta turn this on loop. Jeez, I'm cold without music. Um, so if you've got a slash, we know that this line is for a file name. This is a file, this is a branch, folder, sorry. And then the nice thing about this is like, you can you don't need to encode anything. You do, you do like if, if, if it has a, a space, sorry. There's literally, like you're gonna be amazed. No one gets this. I can't believe no one has figured this out. But this is just, I mean, if with a vertical selection, no escaping needed. So it's just the perfect format for vomit. If I was to be on the vomit committee, I don't know if there's a vomit committee yet, but if you, if you create a vomit standards group, I would like to volunteer. And, um, and this is the format I think should be the standard kind of vomit if you want some the cleanest vomit you could ever ever have all right i'm gonna move on to other things <laughs> thank you cheers <laughs>